Hi guys, this is Bill from Spencer1984.com, and it's been a while since my last update. Uh, we've actually gotten some decent weather around here lately, so I haven't had a whole lot of time for model building projects, as I've been working on outdoor stuff, uh, I've been working on a new shed, been doing some cleanup around the house, and just generally trying to take advantage of the weather while we have it available. Uh, for those of you who follow me on Instagram, Facebook, what have you, you may have seen that I did get this finished, which is my annual second generation charger build. Uh, in this case, in keeping with my 1984 theme, this is the charger that was briefly used in the movie The Philadelphia Experiment. This is Ravel's 69 charger, backdated to a 68 with some parts from my box. And since we never got to see it, I took the opportunity to downgrade the engine to a 318 and downgraded the rear axle as well some light weathering and nothing too intense but just kind of a quick and fun project and I also picked up something else that I'm hoping is going to help out with model shoots if not videos and that's this. I picked this up for 10 bucks on eBay and I'm going to be taking a look at it and seeing how it looks for shooting models. So let me get it set up and we'll be right back. Okay so here I have it set up and as you can see it is pretty small. Got the charger touching both side walls there so there is not a whole lot of extra wiggle room in there but for three-quarter views for photos uh, I think that'll work out pretty nicely it's got two LED strips I've only got one plugged in now but that looks pretty good and uh, I think that will be something that I'll be trying out more of for future photo shoots especially on days where it's overcast or uh, otherwise just inhospitable to trying to get some pictures done so, there's my quick update and even quicker product review. If you want to check one of these out, I'll include a link in the description down below. Otherwise, I'm hoping to be back next week with an update to the Ferrari Daytona. So check back then, and thanks for watching.